When you gather more medals, you can craft new weapons. Hungered behind a computer, Mason Berg is trying out a new game. Below the stone. I've never heard of it before today. But what feels good about being here has nothing to do with how many points he will score, or how many levels he will beat on this screen. This is about the connection he will make away from it. It's been a rough couple of years, so, um, you know, getting to relax and Seeing so many people together is kind of a breath, uh, a breath of fresh air. The governor's order would already make masks mandatory at this type of event. PAX West took it further, requiring proof of vaccination or a negative test. This is our first time sewing anything. Kit Miller came up from Portland and says he will still get tested. Uh, I have the vaccine, uh, but I also got a test before coming to this convention just to make sure I did not have COVID. And I will also be getting a test after this convention probably about five or seven days after, um, just to make sure I was safe and didn't get infected. PAX limited how many people could come into the event and admit they did take some heat for the vaccination mandate, but felt it was the right way to go. It's been difficult to try to account for everyone's health and safety and make sure we can let in as many people as possible. Testing sites around Western Washington have seen a recent surge in activity and numbers could spike after the holiday weekend. Anastasia Sanchez is glad the day in and day out music festival is outdoors and says she's keeping her mask on even if it's not mandatory. I work at a hospital, so I really don't want to put anybody at risk. And the music festival is also requiring proof of vaccination or a negative test within the last 48 hours. A lot of people telling us that you know they do sometimes have some concerns about coming to these large gatherings, but at the same time, they just wanted to get out, be around other people, and try and do it safely. We're live in Seattle. Amy Marino, King 5 News.